comes a new challenger, Jack and Daxter. Locked and loaded, baby. Like it or not, you're going Let down. them all have it, Jack. Hi everyone, this is Enrique from Fighting Game Gems here. I want to talk about a quick character discussion I want to been, been meaning to talk about, which is Jack and Daxter, four places and all sorts, by the way. Out. What I really wanted to talk about is how this character is in this game, as of how the patch is lately. And uh, I wanted to talk about how, is, how he moves, how he fights, free for all, 2v2, 1v1, everything else. Uh, basic generalization of the character. He's really mobile, great in the air, great in everything else. However, as the, as the, to com communicate in uh, att initial attack speed, start at startup and and uh, recovery, he's pretty bad. I like to say this for the month among, among of our other friends in in the group is that Jack is more of a brawl character, as like Smash Brothers brawl. While everyone else in the rest of the roster fights more like a melee character, so they can combo more easily, move with their attacks and uh, like Jack he has to stay still stay in that attack animation until it's all over and by then many other characters can do like two moves ahead of him. As a quick example I'm gonna switch one of my controllers over to human. Like to say for Ratchet, Ratchet's blaster is so fast and you can get out of it real quick. And that's to say for most of the, uh, on like the rest of Jack's moves that cause him to like forcefully do that animation, so he can't cancel the uh, cancel the attack out of it, on like Ratchet's uh, moves at all. Even though it has the same height, it comes out super slow and it's really unuseful, especially since Ratchet's uh, down triangle does reach up more farther. And that's to say for. Uh, for everything else, these characters need, uh, or even though the rivals, you know, I know there's supposed to be differences, but here's another thing. As a compared to uh, other characters like Drake and Isaac Clark, their gun moves and even Red X are a lot more superior as range, attack power, and again, like I said, attack speed in general. Uh, it sucks that, again, a bunch of his moves need to be reworked as of to be more competitive, free for all. 2v2, 1v1s, and everything else. Um, quick example, I'll go through every single one of them real quick. Uh, the Daxter Spin Kick needs to have more power as of uh, being able to walk with it more easily because it, it sucks that you can't keep walking with it. Uh, four Punch needs to really go out more farther because not much of a distance game that you can do with the punch. Uh, this needs to be more cancelled out and maybe a bigger hitbox. But again, I really wish you can uh, cancel the move into it well, a lot more faster, but unfortunately, you can't do as good. Um, his uppercut is great. I wouldn't really change a thing. Maybe more priority on it, because uh, a lot of other moves can, can break it out of it. Uh, Arc Wielder should not keep popping the opponents up upwards. Unlike uh, characters like Isaac, we're going to switch real quick. Sorry about that folks, I uh, don't have a third controller on you right now. Um, his is more like Jack's uh, down triangle, but however it keeps the opponent in place while attacking. And unfortunately, uh, it's real bad to the point where, uh, you know, when you want to use this move, unfortunately it pops him up and he can't do much, you can't counter attack with the level 1, because unfortunately, guess what, other characters can uh, react faster than you can and well, you're dead. Um, again, I would like to see that like just like how it was shown in the original uh, video for Jack when it was introduced that the move is supposed to keep him in the attack and not popping up and a lot more meter would be a lot better than just what 14 and that's for attacking two characters in a row um, this needs to be reworked completely the four triangle blaster um, the recovery but it's what hurts it most of all because he can't 
you can't jump fast enough out of it compared to other characters and it it's just it's horrible it's it, if it was you know it's it reaches farther than Drake's AK AK47 ratchets and even Isaac's little gun however I have to be forced with the movie even the the game's little trick about you being able to cancel as soon as you land doesn't even let him get out of it so uh, not only that 18 meter is not that great to compare to so you can collect enough meter to do your supers and uh, it really needs to be reworked um, attack speed maybe range if not cancelability and again uh, recovery and startup uh, next I want to talk about the up triangle the peacemaker this is complete trash as it is right now I mean um, it's supposed to be a lot like Redix neutral triangle I believe it is where he throws the electric grenade and the explosion is supposed to stay up for a little while uh, just like in his own game unfortunately it doesn't stay as long and it needs a it should have a homing ability just like in his own game but of course you know you can make everything like their own game as their own characters but uh, again I like to see more meter because 5 meter is not that great um, the explosion radius should stay longer and, may, and would be nice to see a homing ability on them on the weapon uh, down triangle again just like the normal four triangle this thing is super bad with good recovery because unfortunately every other character in the game can just easily get him as soon as he's stuck in that animation I mean yes you can cancel this with the punch but unfortunately you know uh, other characters can easily read you as soon as you see as soon as they see you do that uh, next would be uh his his standard circle the only thing i have to say bad about this is that they, they lied to us about the last patch how this thing's supposed to be hitting the wall and bouncing back off so it goes back the other direction but unfortunately it keeps exploding on contact uh i love it how it has great range and five meter i would like a little more meter gain because unfortunately not every bullet hits the opponent it would be nice to see if not more meter than maybe a tracking ability again uh, in the in his own game the the gyro buster does does track his opponent and does an auto targeting thing um, forward circle all I have to say is that this thing nearly needs to have more range maybe more stopping power or more meter but again I like to see more uh, more range because unfortunately uh, when when trying to do in 1v1 or 2v2 it's real hard to try to check down your opponent with this especially since uh, with its own tracking ability it's, it loses its power as soon as it, you know the, your opponent does a rapid uh, change of direction next I want to talk about is up triangle the worst move in his arsenal ever it's just like uh, good cold level 1 good or evil cold level 1 however uh, this thing has an odd hitbox it's like half of what that level 1 is um, Unfortunately, uh, like even if you get within the circle, the edge of the rim of the circle, it doesn't exactly get them. And uh, I like to see more meter than just five because that's real. That's real pathetic to have only this good, good kind of a move that should be in this move uh, be trash because everyone could just blow right through it. I like to see if not armor, uh, so that you you can take you can absorb a hit without losing the animation. Uh, if not, I really like to see a bigger radius, more around and above them, especially uh, or not, than the the area of effect being more uh, bigger, wider and taller. And if not, not all those. And I like to see that the person that's trapped within the attack stay floated a bit longer, because yeah, uh, they pop out way too fast, and you can't get them with the level one. You can't combo just right. Like it's extremely timely what we need to do to follow up this attack so again um, more meter than just five bigger radius maybe armor the area of an effect time limit needs to be extended longer or the effect of uh, how how they get affected by the gravity field next is the down circle it's been rough since the, the last patch for the default down circle it's redu uh, reduced in size um, again, people think, oh, you jack, you just, this is all you're going to do. Well, unfortunately, because of how he is, this is the greatest move that has the most meter gain and can lead up into other moves. Just like that. But unfortunately, you know, like, you need, these other moves need to be focused on a lot more better. But unfortunately, you know, 
1v1, 2v2, free for alls. It's all horrible. And uh, again, all I'd like to see maybe is if, <laughs> if they can bring back the original size. I believe I talked about just about everything else about his moves, so I'm gonna talk about his levels. His supers, I mean. Sorry about that, folks. His level 1 is meant to have as a quick reaction to everyone else. Uh, its activation is super fast, unfortunately. Its Jack's body is the hitbox. So it's an odd little, like, side, sidewards, pointing upwards uh, trapezoid. And unfortunately, I like to see this a lot more better than what it could be. Um, if having Daxter as the hitbox would be uh, good enough, so in case you're, uh, you're trying to chase an opponent, uh, you can do that. If not, uh, make the vent on the bottom be a hitbox, or as soon as he lands, causes a little, little blast of eco, causing another hitbox. So as soon as he does a little animation, falls back down and causes another super around his feet or something. I mean, that'd be really great. So uh, uh, more height as uh, adding Dax with a little hitbox, or maybe extending uh, the hitbox around his feet more where the vent, the base of the vent. Level 2 uh, had been buffed since the last patch. Uh, if anyone is, of course, near the activation of his level 2, they get immediately shocked and uh, they get trapped and they're locked in long enough so the Jack can hit him with the level 2. The only bad thing about the Super is that if you use it on another Jack, they'll, have, they'll glitch out of it where this shock animation will just pop out super fast immediately and uh, they'll survive well, a good 50% 50, 50 of the time. Um, Besides the glitch, I don't see anything else wrong with this super, uh, level 2 super. Um, it's great for, you know, what it is now. And uh, I have no problem with this level 3. Which is the light eco jack form. The only bad thing I have to say is that uh, if Jack's feet get cut on a platform, he will get stuck and you're going to have to waste time going up and then going around. Other than that, that's pretty much it. Um, so again... Those little notes about it reworking his his complete uh, attack speed would be greatly helped, and uh, some properties on his moves and his supers. His one is level one and two, but again, what he really needs is more meter gain, better recovery animation, so that he can cancel his moves and get out of what he can do. Because compared to Isaac, Drake, and Ratchet, and the rest of everyone else in the cast for All Stars, they're just too fast for Jack. As fast as uh, attack speed wise. Uh, movement speed, he's it's fine, but unfortunately this game needs to buff Jack. Help Jack up, guys. Play, uh, Sony PlayStation, Sony Santa Monica, and the developers of the patch, uh, I ask you to please, uh, this great character of ours, please, and uh, thank you guys again. Like it or not, you're going Let's down. get this wimp!